Hi guys, welcome to Abjada. So in this one, I'm trying to solve one issue that I have is when you have a lot of components in your uh, routes, let's say there is index, there is a boat, there is a directory, let's say, and the directory has many um, routes. So what I want is all these routes to be listed somewhere or I can access all those routes so that I can create a, you know, uh, probably like a sidebar or a like navigation menu or something. Now that isn't available so far, but there is still some hope because there is a issue open and I'm, I'm thinking this will be solved pretty soon. Uh, in Routify, however, we have something called layout and you can get those, you know, get the routes as children of that layout. Now you can install uh, this particular um, package in your swell kit and uh, maybe uh, do this but sometimes it can throw errors that it might depend on window object I have faced that uh, but there is uh, one way to solve it in uh, swell kit which I am trying and uh, let's see how to do that so uh, let's create some routes here let's say about dot swell uh, let's also create a directory called docs or something and then we'll have uh, some files here intro dot svelte maybe installation dot svelte i will also have another directory inside this and a file called another dot svelte now, in order to get all these, uh, you know, uh, files, let's create a layout. Let's have a slot here. That way, you know, uh, all the content is there. And I will also have a script tag. And I will use this uh, weeds uh, feature, which is you can get all the files or whatever you know, files you want. Uh, using meta.glob uh, so I'll just use that import so instead of this dot slash I'll use a, a double star and then I'll use dot swelt uh, this should get us all the all the components we have we'll log out all the modules see to see what what is in there let me open local host and console and I have all these you know um, modules now using this we can actually generate uh, probably a kind of a menu uh, let's let's see how to do that now first thing is I will uh, try to do that in a load function so I'll use context module I'll, I have imported all this and then um, let all something like all menu or something equals an empty uh, array now let's loop through uh, all the modules for uh, let's say let path in modules all right um, now all menu dot push uh, path so path is what we are interested in let's push that and we'll console log all menu here instead of modules and let's see if uh, we get that yeah we are getting all the you know uh, items here but this is an array uh, we might need something like a, like an object which has a title and also a link right so while pushing instead of path let's do something like uh, title and link or even you can do url so now it's an object um, but both are same but we can do something about this so path is pretty easy uh, i'm guessing something like path dot uh, replace let me do that here. Um, let clean. Okay, I can do this inside clean path. 
equals path dot replace here instead of dots world I'm just gonna remove that that's all so that's that's a clean path so we'll just use that as link and that should give us a cleaner you know uh, slash okay so that also uh, we might not need that uh, dot slash instead we'll just have a slash in the beginning so this should give us a uh, much cleaner uh, path here slash yeah this is good uh, now for the title what we want is in this string whatever we have here um, we just want maybe about here in this case we want installation so in order to do that uh, i saw something in uh, stack overflow clean path here uh, and then dot substring uh, it is a substring of clean path so uh, again clean path and uh, dot last uh, index of slash and then we use plus one here so in this case what happens here in our title is uh, we get the title the proper title and proper link uh, now one more thing is you know having index uh, is not a good idea for title um, if it is index I mean maybe we should do something about it and also for the link having slash index doesn't make sense so in that case for the link um, having you know title as index is fine uh, slash index as a as a link will fail so we can do something if it, you know we can check that if uh, in link uh, dot includes index if it includes index you can just do clean path uh, dot replace index with uh, nothing actually and if not you can just use uh, clean path okay. this is kind of hacky but if you find something uh, better I mean just let me know because I want to use this um, okay now here what happened is we got something cleaner the link is for index it's uh, slash uh, but again, so imagine you have uh, one more uh, like inside the doc you have an index uh, That also will remove the you know um, Let's let's see what happens inside more inside docs. I'll have index dot right Right in that case uh, What's gonna happen is that also will be you know uh, given the name index and then it's actually docs um, uh, it uh, doesn't make sense, but maybe we should uh, instead of uh, something like maybe instead last index, let's see if it can be index of n plus one. I mean, what happens there? Yeah, so this this actually makes sense. Locks index and yeah, this is this is this is fine. I think index of is actually fine. Okay, so that's uh, we have it so, and I'll have a load function here because sometimes you know it may not get resolved const load equals uh, I'll have an asynchronous function um, and inside I'll have const menu equals uh, await promise um, dot all all menu all right once that is there i can return that as a prop return props menu now we should have that uh, you can receive that here script export that menu and then we can have an each loop here uh, each uh, menu as item or something and close that now inside here um, maybe outside we'll have a an ordered list inside we have a list item 
uh, a list item and an a tag and here we'll do item dot link i think it is yeah it is link and item dot title okay so do we get that here let's see yeah we are getting it now what happens you know we have uh, all these things listed all the pages we had are all listed even the index pages so this is the index page if i click on it nothing happens if i go to about it will show empty the reason is you know i don't have anything in those pages if i have something they might show up i'll try installation Uh, just for showing this installation intro I'll just have those two pages about has come already installation intro so far you know this is how you can list all these pages you can maybe um, have a sidebar and list all these things but I'm still hoping for something to come out of uh, this PR uh, if that happens you know it's gonna be awesome so until then you can you can use this method i mean let me know if this is good or you have a better way of doing this uh, in that case you know i'll i'll, I'll use that thanks guys bye bye